Hello, welcome to my favourite things. Hello, hello, hello. hello. Do you know it's only taken us about three and a half years to work together again? I know, I know. It doesn't seem that long now. I know, I know. Why rush these things? Exactly. Yeah. yeah Good yeah, things. Yeah. Are meant to be waited for, aren't they? That's absolutely, the and we've been waiting for these. We have, we have yeah. indeed. Yeah, yes. yeah, brand new company here to Achanda. My favourite things from America. From America, yes. Uh, wonderful company. Now I have been posting some sneaky peeks on social media, and it seems that a lot of people are aware of the company already. I had not heard see of them. them. Here. So I was, I was incredibly, well, I like anything new. So from the states yes. what else do we know about them yes well i can tell you that the quality of their items are absolutely exceptional as well so this isn't a made we, in china situation no, 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 is it this no. is this is american steel exactly oh. yes made in the usa um absolutely they're crafters they know right. what they're doing they've got something different here um the steel is made in the usa the dyes are so strong there's no flimsiness about them at all. There's so much detail in them. They're very quirky, some of them as well. We've got all sorts of different things. We've got very f fun elements here. We've got uh, florals here as well today. We've got things that are very, very useful. Um, I've got to the, say, the first yeah. thing is my favourite, actually. I love this. I just love this. We all, we all, well, I say we all, I don't like doing it, actually, but most of us like to take selfies, don't we? Well, this my is based on the selfies. I just think this is fabulous. So you've got all sorts. It's a big stamp set that we've got here as well, and it's not just the stamps. You've got the dies as well. So, the so you could do, so like, you know, fun. I mean, we always did it as teenagers, you know, yeah. in the in the photo booth with, yes. your, with your mate. How many people could you yeah. stick in the photo booth to get the photos? Yeah. And this has had a resurgence, hasn't it? It has. You get photo booths at weddings, birthdays, exactly. all those sorts of things. So to be able to, I mean, I made a collage of the last wedding that I went to. We took so many photos in the photo booth. But actually, to be able to have made a card or something like that to then send back as a thank you yeah. for the f fabulous time that we had. And of course, you've got stamps to add in as well. You have, and well, it looks like they're in the booth. Look, they're putting their thumbs up, you know, yeah. they're against the screen. The cat's on top of the dog, and the dog's not into, looking too happy about it. You know, it's great. But you've got the dies as well, so you can cut these out. You've got the stamps for the selfie sort of sentiments in there. But what about using your own photographs as well? Brilliant. What about your journaling? Brilliant. Use these for your journaling as well. I mean, use your own photographs. You know, snippings from magazines I'm thinking, and things um, that mean something to you. A slightly different Valentine card that would be with a good photos idea. of you and the other half be lovely that would be a very yeah. good idea yeah yeah and also I think what I love about these stamps is because they're so fun they're actually ageless as well like my, my children would love that but also it's fun for adults as well exactly and so you've got the stamps there you've got the different they're individual as well you've got lots of sentiments in there you've got the individual characters in there which are so funny and you have got those dies as well which i've got to say you can see i think on the screen there you can see that we've got cutting edges around the die and also the individual let's say the windows cut mm. out as well so you have got you know different ways of working with these Fabulous. as well and you can have them um in two payments as well which always helps Absolutely fabulous. Uh, now, your code for that is 711017. Two flexi buys of £26. Yes. For something yep. completely fabulous. different. Now, <laughs> I adore this. Yes. Um, Catherine, I don't know about you. I have teenage nieces. They don't want presents from me anymore. I used to make them jewellery and stuff. They don't want that anymore because I'm not trendy. <laughs> what they want is cold, hard cash. They do. And quite frankly, I don't want to give them cash. I want to give them a gift voucher so at least I can sort of, you know, yeah. channel where I'd like it spent. Yes. And, and this is fabulous. And it looks as though you've then made the effort to go out and buy something, yes. doesn't it? Rather than yes. just putting the cash in there. And it's great to be able to present something, no, no, no. you know, in a, in a nice way. And this is done in a very, very nice way. So, so what you're getting is the dies to do, uh, well, to cut, to cut out sort of the aperture, if you yep. will. Yeah, exactly. And then you can do, as we had here, you can then cut out the, the surrounding bit. But look at this. You get ten pockets to put those gift cards in. You do. And you could make shakers with them as well, of course, but ideal for your gift cards. Uh, you know, it could, it, there's all sorts of gift cards nowadays as well, isn't there? It's yeah. not just for your jewellery. It's not just for, I mean, the one there for a coffee shop. But you find cards for all sorts of reasons. Yeah. Make your own as well. What about making your own? Do you know, yeah, and one of my, um, for my birthday last year, one of my producers gave me a gift card for a <coughs> coffee place. 
well-known coffee place. And actually, I took my daughter one morning, and we just we went and had a morning's coffee Aww. together. We were ladies that you know did did tea and coffee, and it was just lovely. And I wouldn't have done it if I didn't have the voucher. And it was just, and it was yes. so nice. And she sat there in a little high chair, having like, it's the gift of time. <laughs> yes, it is. It's like perfect. That. So I absolutely love this. And we haven't even mentioned all of the stamps that you get. We haven't. No, you've got lots and lots of sentiments here as well. So you can see they work perfectly, gentlemen. This one's on me. A little gift and a big thanks. Thanks for doing that that thing you did. I mean, these are nice. They're different to sentiments I've seen yes. before. Spoil yourself. It's on me. I mean, ideal for anything that you're gifting. Yep. So yep. whether you're working with the dies that are in the set or using those individually, you're going to find many, many uses for those stamps. My sister-in-law, I buy sort of... Um, department store vouchers for because she's got two small children and she doesn't spend it on herself if I give her cash I know it'll go on the kids if I yeah. give her a store card then I know that she'll go and buy herself something nice for her spoil yourself on me that perfect sentiments in exactly there. exactly two flexi buys there you can spoil yourself too uh, and your um, your number there eight eight nine six eight nine I love these. They're fabulous, aren't they? They really, they really are. are different. Now, these have already started selling, I can tell you that already, um, because they're a little bit different. They are. Now, these are really, really sweet. Now, I love the little mouse. Unfortunately, we haven't got the mouse on today's show, but we have got that wonderful aperture, yes. that cutout yes. there. And again, you're going to get the plastic shaker uh, circles with them as well. So you can use the die with or without the plastic pieces. If you want to make a shaker card, yes, that's great. But as you can see in the sample there, oh, that one has got the shakers in, but the one with the little mouse, just stamp into the aperture. Yeah. You don't Use need the shaker, do you? Exactly. The shakers are nice you to have. You don't have to have the shakers, but they're there if you want them. And it is going to give you a different, a different looking card, and I like that. Let's look then at the other ones that complement this absolutely beautifully. You don't get the shakers with these, so you're going to be able to make cards like this. But like we say, the shakers are nice to have. <laughs> but it could, could be a little picture. It could be. It could be a photograph again. You know, you, there's lots of ways you can work with this. But I love the fact that you've got the happy birthday going around mm. the edge there. We've got various different sentiments here within this bundle. Uh, so something for all occasions, really. You've got the congratulations there. You've got the hugs, or the big hugs. And you've got thank you as well. The big hugs you can use for any time, can't you? Of course you can. You can hug you can. somebody whenever that you want to hug them. even be a sympathy card. Yeah. Couldn't it? Yeah. You know, yep, so really uh, like thirty-two ninety. The cards we don't want to make, but have to make. Here you go. They're <laughs> there. Thirty-two ninety-nine um, and three six eight three six three eight rather three seven six three seven, three seven one. <laughs> I can't even read today. That's that's always going well, isn't it? Now let's have a look at the next one. Dies and stamps. Dies and stamps. Now these are really nice. You've got your words again here. Your sentiments. A nice big smile look. We all like to smile, don't we? We've got hello in there as well. But again, your sentiments, really, really nice. You know, all very sort of uplifting sort of sentiments, I would say. I think it's fabulous and, again, timeless. Definitely. Um, I struggle. And also, it can be for boys or girls. It certainly can. Now, I love cards like this because the simplicity says it all for me. I mean, just a little bit of cardstock there, embossed wording. You know, you've got lots of sentiments there. Again, great for your journaling these because of the size of them. You can stamp onto strips. You can stamp directly onto a page. You know, what? whatever you've already got in your stash, they're going to work with. So you've got lots and lots to go at here. These really, are really fab, handy. I'm indeed. enjoying these. Doesn't that look fabulous? Oh. I mean, it's very simple again, but really, really nice. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Um, and this, this is a Freedom Members price of forty-five eighty-nine. Is this a, is this a why don't you? <laughs> why don't? What are they called? <laughs> why, why not, not you? Deal? Why don't, what? I thought it was a show, wasn't it? <laughs> why not, why? <laughs> you know the one where even if uh, you sign up for Freedom yes. and pay that yep. for your postage, that means you get free postage for the month. Yeah. Um, and you buy this, yeah. you've, you're still saving you on top of are. that. That's, that's it. So, yeah, why don't you do it is basically exactly. where in that's my head one. that's what it is. <laughs> and you've got, fle hang on, Flexi Freedom. <laughs> so many things. Uh, which means that you can do that over two instalments. You can. 22 95 this month. I was going to say plus your PMP, but it won't because it's all in there. That's, that's it. If you're freedom. a freedom member, yeah, yeah, that's yeah. What it's all about. Actually, you only have to shop three times, and it's worth it. It certainly is. Yeah. yeah, and you can try it out. There's no contract. You can try it for a month. If you don't like it, just don't roll it over. Cracking. Love it. Love it. Right. Let's have a look at the next ones. I love these. You do, don't I you? I do love these. 
Um, flowers, quite yeah. frankly, never go out of fashion. They don't, do they? They are really, really nice. Now, the quality of the stamps, we've seen the dyes, but the, we've seen some stamps already, but they are photon polymer. They're really, really good quality. They're not going to disintegrate. They're going to last you, last you. Of course, you can stamp with all sorts of different inks as well to do different techniques. I just think these stamps are absolutely beautiful. Um, oh. The samples we've got here, obviously, have been cut out. We've got the stamps there. You can cut out if you want to, if you cut around one. them. You can stamp, you can make your backgrounds, you can layer up, you can use your embossing inks as well you know and about your this one? powders what do you love about that one well you've got succulents there which you, you don't they're not you know normally it's roses or tulips or you know something more classical but i really love that it's fresh succulents are fantastic yeah in they're fact we've exactly we have alive. been seeing succulents a lot in wedding bouquets yes. and, and table decorations yeah. for weddings um, so they've become very very popular very, very popular, and you can now stamp all about it. Yes, you can. And again, that's on two flexi buys as well of just £24. Fabulous. Um, let's have a look at the website because that's where you can shop ahead. That's where you can get ahead, get everything that you want. Well, these are rather fabulous. Loving those shaker cards. Now, are we... Look at those. Oh, just we haven't even got to them all. There are so many on the show. Uh, but do take a look on the web. Shop ahead on the web. Make the most of that flexi basket would be my... Um, that, that is possibly the biggest pair of scissors. <laughs> just a discreet little <laughs> pair there. They're bigger than you are. <laughs> Do you know, I was given these a while ago to try out. They are for paper. They're not. Okay. So, they are for, They're very heavy. They're very good quality. Uh, and I have, been, I have been working with them. I've been using them. God, they're going to mess with you, are they? <laughs> <laughs> Blimey. <laughs> right, what are we doing then? Right, okay, well, we're going to start with the selfies. So, um, I adore these. I think they're so much fun. Now, the cardstock I've used there is, it's from Pink Frog. Okay. Um, oh, so you know the quality you get It's their standard, but uh, I've, you know, we can stamp on it, we can ink on it, we can make card bases of it, with it. We can. I'm going to do a little bit of watercolour on it as well. I'm not going to over wet it, otherwise I would be using. If I was using a lot of water, I'd go for a proper watercolour card, which we may do some of later. Um, I'm using some ink here from Picket Fence. I know in the last show, Alex was asking Samantha about what ink she was using for the alcohols. I've got some alcohol pens here. Uh, this is a really good one, actually, Picket Fence Studios. We should have it on the, on the website. We've had it here a number of times. It works great with your watercolours. It works great with your alcohol pens. Wait, um, hang on, hang on, because not all of them will do alcohol a, and water. No, it's a hybrid so ink. So it, it, I didn't it's know very, such very existing. Yes, it's really good. I've used it a lot. I've had done picket fence shows, and I've fallen in love with their products as well. And wow. it's just nice to uh, to be able to continue using the inks and things. Now then, I did bring all my alcohol pens with me, yeah. which have been stored away for quite some time. Yeah. And when I started using them, some of them didn't seem at their best. So I've decided for the demonstration, I'm actually going ink. to paint with distress oxide instead. Do it. Why not? So this, I've got limited colours actually, but so I'm just going to work with what I've got. This is iced spruce. Ooh, iced spruce, uh, which is it's kind of a grey, greeny grey sort it's of nice. colour. So I'm just going to paint in. I might have to put my glasses on in a minute. Um, I'm losing my eyesight now. You see, I'm getting old. Oh, um, I'm getting I'm, old. I'm ignoring that fact <laughs> for me. <laughs> Let me just grab. Let me just grab. Oh, I've got some new viewers today. Hello. Hello, got, hello, welcome. We've got some new, yeah, new yeah, yeah, viewers. Yeah. Oh, wonderful. So thank you for wonderful. joining us. New product, new viewers, it's all new. It certainly is. So what I'm doing here, just a little bit of ink, and I've started around, around you see, I'm no expert colourist, but mm. anybody can do this with their inks. But you can see I'm just pulling the colour down there, yeah. working into the detail of the stamp, uh, so it's kind of fading out. So I'm giving it that, that different look. That I'm really just going to stick with this one colour and going a little bit more intense around the eyes here as well. Now this would have looked nice if um, I'd have used a black embossing powder as well okay. to really, really sort of pick out the detail. So I'm just adding a little bit more colour. You see my ink is black but if you wanted it really intense then obviously going over the top with a clear embossing ink and bringing that brightness out or the, the, you know, it really makes the black come out, or using a black embossing ink, a powder, sorry, not ink, um, then of course you can change the look and you can have a very crisp sort of finish to it. But oh, these are rather <laughs> lovely. They <laughs> both are, look at their little pink. I know. Wow, they're are they so going to be cute, pink pores or not? Are I'm they going to be inky pores? I am going to put 
pink on this one, I think. I'm just going to build it a little bit more colour and I'm going to fade it out onto into the centre a little bit there. Oh. Now, normally, you you haven't worked with me for a long time, Natasha. No, it has been a while. Oh, you know, if I'm working with clay, if I'm working with fabrics, if I'm working with cardstock, usually I carry a powder blusher with me to do the little rosy cheeks. Oh. I usually always do it, but I can't find it today. Oh. So, oh. so I'm going to have to do it with ink instead, okay. but that's fine. You can do it. You that's can do fine. It. So I'm just using the same brush. I'm going to just add some little rosy cheeks. He needs he needs a middle <laughs> onto the little cat here, okay. And then oh, I've missed a little bit of the paw there. Let's just go back in. Have you got cats or just your dogs? I've got dogs. I have had cats in the past. We had a cat that once lived to be twenty-two years old. No. Yes. Oh my goodness. Now let's just. Add oh a little lovely. bit of red. This is, uh, again, this is an ink I'm using here. I've got various different inks that have worked with water. So I'm just building up a bit of colour, adding, you know, water where I need it, pulling the colour out, just to change the depth of colour in there. So I'm just going in with a little bit of pink into the ears But this as is well. the sort of thing, if someone does have cats, then you can personalise it, can't you? To their, of their sort of, their coloured cats. Yep, of course. Uh, and we've got all those other animals in there as well. We've got dogs in there. Are we've they got hamsters? monkeys in there. We've they're got the hamsters, sloth. Yeah. Yes, we've got hamsters. Hamsters are guinea pigs. I think they're I guinea think pigs. they could be either. I think they're guinea I pigs. think they could be either because you can't see the tail. So I think they could be either. Um, and monkeys as well because let's face it, we've all got cheeky monkeys in our lives, <laughs> haven't we? Um, oh, I was going to take those. Yes, the sloth is in there as well. And my, that's my daughter's favourite animal is a sloth. Is it? Yeah. Actually, they're very popular at the moment. Very, um, they are, aren't they? Yeah. They and are. a very long suffering dog there, looking slightly confused with the cat. <laughs> Amazing. <laughs> they're fabulous. They Just are fabulous, fabulous, aren't they? So now I'm not going to spend much longer colouring in because we want to use some of the dyes, but um, I would continue colouring in, even into the background as well. I'm, I would spend more time at home obviously use your pens use your pencils uh, your color crayons I've got the ink tents with me as well I love the ink tents my um my son turned six last week did he's he really? got his yeah 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 how did that <gasps> happen and um, he's got his thank you cards to write and um, and actually this is something that he could stamp and yeah. then color in himself for his thank you cards it certainly is do you know I'm so pleased to hear that someone still writes thank you cards. You see, we were always taught to write thank you cards and not many people do it now. Oh, no, no, we, no, as far as I'm concerned, if people have taken the time and effort to go and get you something, they could spend their money on anything. It doesn't have to be on him, you know, then they he has to say could. thank you for it. They certainly could. Absolutely. I'm a great believer in, uh, in still writing letters. Yeah. Well, he likes to receive them, so he likes to send them. Oh, no, it's, it's a good lesson to teach. Yeah. It really is. Right, so we'll, we'll leave that there for now. Obviously, I'd put a background in there and we'd sort of work on that a little bit more. Uh, what I am going to do is just get my large pair of scissors. <laughs> Your discreet <laughs> blades. <laughs> yeah. Yes, I'm just ones. going to roughly cut around that frame there because we are going to use that selfie frame and we're going to okay. stamp into it as well. So just take that little bit away. I did actually cut one out beforehand. But I've not lost it. So using the die you can see what you actually get is is the frame but also you've got the square that comes out in the middle as well oh, so keep okay. that because you can use that as well absolutely uh, but we're going to build a little frame around this so just make sure when you trim down that you've trimmed it so it's not going to stick out on the side right. you might have to put a little bit more of a trimmed edge on there but we're going to stamp a sentiment on there as well which i'll come back to but also We've got some other dies that uh, we can use as well. So, using this one here, this is the wonky, the wonky, wonky stitched rectangles. Yeah. I love these. I love them because they are wonky stitched. Oh no, they are. They are wonky stitched. Yes. 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 Anything that's got detail in, stitching detail, I think is fabulous. Um, well, we draw it in often, don't we? If it's missing off off dies, often we, you know, we, we do a faux stitch drawn in. We do. So this is lovely that it's it's on there. It is. And, um, and also, it's a nesting set too that you can get. 
Exactly. Now then, I've just realised I've misplaced one of my plates. So I'm about uh -oh. to see if Shana can grab me another plate. Oh, it's here. I found it. It's all right. So I've got it. Picked it up with some paper. I did have one I cut out earlier, but we'll just send this through just so you can see these. So remember the dies themselves. This really, is really strong. It's steel. It's not coming from china or anywhere like that these are created in the usa this is usa steel there is a difference yes really really good quality you're paying for quality here uh, so i'm just going to pop that into the die cutting machine i'm not going to tape it down because i've only got one die in there so okay. i know it's going to be okay and these are the dies that you're getting in the set there's all of those yes you get so a lot they've all got that detailing in so you could use those just to layer up by themselves you could, you certainly could. They are really, really nice. Look at the detail that, of the does stitching. Does that cut all the way through in that stitching, or is it just it sort does, of... No, it does. Uh, if I turn it around, look, you can see on the back as well. It does go all the way so through. So if you wanted to take a thread, oh, I'd love yep. a variegated thread you, or something. You could and certainly just stitch into that. For a special a card. A nice metallic thread or something like that would look really yeah. nice so as well. So Christmas cards, you can start definitely, one. Definitely, definitely. I know we've just sort of done that, but... You know. Yes, but people start make for now. Christmas all year round, yeah. don't they? Yeah, yeah. They certainly do. Right, we're a little bit more die cutting to do in a second, but let's choose one of the selfie, one of the selfie um, sentiments. Sentiments. I was going to say motto, but our friendship is picture perfect. I like that. Oh. So I think we'll go with that one. So I'm just going to grab my stamping platform. Um, this is very cool. The platform. Yeah. <laughs> have yeah. You, have you not seen these? No. Have you not? No. Where have they been all oh, my life? Oh, they're fabulous, aren't they? Well, the thing is, if so you, you don't perfectly stamp, or you're not very good at getting things in the right place... This is it. You can go back in. The only thing is, don't do what I've done. Don't lose your magnets. Because really, I could do with holding that down, but never mind. Let's hope it doesn't move and we get it first time. So a little bit of the ink again. Again, I could emboss the sentiment if I wanted to, but I'm just going to go in with the ink. You know, one set of the dies that I haven't had a chance to play with much is the tag kit, but I think we might oh, have no, a play with that. I've got it in my hand. Look, 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 look. Here we go, because this is the other thing that would work perfectly with this set, I think. And here they are. So this is your tag builder. So again, that's going to yes, work beautifully with the circular with sentiments as well. And you can build up your tags. Oh, look, you've got all of the little hearts and, um, and stars. I know there's so much on there. I think now we, I will, we will put some out and see what we can do with that. Actually. If like you if you use use those to cut out all the little stars and the hearts, yeah, then you could make your own sort of confetti that can then go in you, your shape. You can. We might add some to our little selfie card. Ooh, actually. Oh yeah. Right. So I'm going to stick my little frame behind it. I'll finish the background later. Even though we. Uh, we haven't done this already and I'm putting this together. I can still could go you, in and um, do that afterwards. Could you put some um, of the foam tape in and raise it? You could do. You could do. Um, it's quite a narrow frame, but you certainly could do. You can trim the frame down, uh, the tape down, of course. Now, what I like about this, when you put the frame around it, you do lose a little bit of the pitch, but for me, that works so well because it is like somebody's yeah, in that booth yeah. and they're, they're trying to jump out, you know, and they're kind of on the screen. Uh, really good fun. Really good fun. Right, let's get one of the toppers. I'm just going to stick this directly onto a card. Because this was the one, when we, um, when we were prepping for the show and we went down the counter, this, this was the one that you absolutely were like, no, no, no. In fact, we moved it, it up so that you could play with it. <laughs> I really, really <laughs> like this set. I just think it's such good fun. It, you know, we all need to smile, don't we? We yes. all need to smile, and I think this makes us smile. Uh, there's a lot of sentiments in there. I mean, we're all animal lovers, or we should be. If we're not, we should be. But most people are, aren't they? So we have pets. We love anything with animals on that are funny. You know, and so also it being those able gaps. to make a card that is on trend, Yes. You know, in terms of selfies. Yeah. Um, but that you can use, like we say, if you want to personalise with your own photos as well, that you can use for all ages is absolutely perfect. I struggle with small children's birthday cards. Yeah. Oh, these are fabulous for children absolutely. and adults alike, I absolutely. think. Absolutely. 
I'll tell you what we'll do. I think we'll have now these um, these dies, Natasha. Mm. When you get them, they do all come with the little tabs. So they come on one sheet. You've got the little tabs, so you can just break the little tags apart. I've left some of these together simply because I am terrible at losing bits and pieces. Okay. And I haven't got any envelopes. To put them in at the minute. So I've left those together. So. You know, I may separate them later, but let's just well, send them through. Well, then it's safe to machine. send it through, isn't it? They're not going to cross over in there. Yeah, it depends what you're cutting out. Obviously, if you don't separate them and you want something specific cutting out, then you may find that something's in the way. Come on, we've all got um, a cardboard box full of, so um, of little bits of little <laughs> sentiments and extra bits just for when we might need them. Haven't we? We have. Yeah. We certainly have. Now this, if I cut this out a lot, you see you've got a lovely well, little tag there. This is another one that's great for your journals as well. Because you've got your reinforcers there, look. You've got your little... No! Your little is that what they're for? Yeah, you could use those for those. Um, so put them onto your tags, put them onto your oh, pages, onto your rings, your holes for your rings. You've got these other little tags, and this is just one... Oh, you could put ribbons through those, set. couldn't you? Ribbons would be fantastic. Oh. So we're going to use one or two of those as well. And I think I am going to send through... Uh, oh, we've got some fabulous cardstock on today as well, I think. Um, is it deal of the day we've got? It is our deal of the day. Should we, should we talk about that? I Very haven't briefly. seen it, but I've heard it's Anna Griffin, isn't it? Is that it? was what rumour had it. <sighs> well, I know it's going to be good then. Well, look at this. So, Le Blanche 24. Oh, it's Le Blanche. Yeah, oh, I, yeah, yeah. Oh, well, even better. 12 by 12, Anna Griffin papers and six die cut sheets. Should have been twenty three ninety nine. Deal of the day, just nine ninety nine. That's amazing. Saving fourteen pounds. Fantastic, fantastic quality, fantastic papers, fantastic company. Right now then. Oh yes, we haven't mentioned um, on the day. On the, that's on the the deal of the day is extended delivery. First of February that goes out. So just so that you know, where's it coming from? See, somebody's saying know. Anna Griffin again. It is yeah. Blanche, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. See, all these, all these papers. They come companies. from Germany, don't oh, they? Oh, they're German, yeah. right. Now, I've just cut that. I'm not going to use this on this particular demonstration, but you can see this is just one of the elements from that tag maker. That could be a pretty small So you've bauble, got your. It? it is, isn't it? Yeah. So you could do all sorts with that little picture behind there, sentiment again, but I wanted to use those little. Those little hearts there. Aren't they gorgeous? And also, I've got one of the little tags there as well, which I'm just going to pop there. Could and you just stick one of those little hearts where the paws are? Could you what? Sorry. Put one of those little hearts where the paw in, where the paws could, are. Couldn't you? Should we try that? Yeah. Let me see if I can find something very delicate to add some glue with. Uh, doo -doo -doo. Um, I just think these are beautiful. D very, very different selfies. I certainly haven't seen dies and stamped combinations like this before. These are brand new to us. Uh, they're from a company called My Favourite Things. They're an American company. This is American steel. So none of that made in China. This is American steel. So you know you're getting top quality. Lots of you are very excited to hear that we had this. Yes. Oh, it does work on the little paw, look. Oh, look. Look. Oh. <laughs> Oh, what about a nose? On the nose, nose, yeah. I'm now using, we've started. I'm using the wrong end of my um, paintbrushes Whatever simply because works. I've got a brand new paintbrush and I don't want to get glue on the bristles. <laughs> <laughs> we'll just do it oh, on the little grey one. Oh, just look at that. <laughs> <laughs> now that was that was from uh, the Tag Builder blueprints. That's down the bottom of the screen there. Aren't they fab? I need to pop one just under the frame there to match the other paw up, but I'll do that in a little while. And oh. I want to build the background up. But I, you see, I would just scatter one or two of these little hearts around on the card as well, just to add a little bit more detail and bring the colours together as well. Love that. Lovely choice of colours there as well, Catherine. How beautiful. So if you would like uh, to get that stamp and die set today, then it's uh, 7110. One seven. That is your code in order to get these. Uh, now let's talk about foam, because Ooh, actually these are just asking for that little bit of lift from a bit of foam tape. They are. That's what I would have done with the Picture Perfect 
area of that uh, card there. I would have lifted it up a little bit. This is a great buy, actually. Well, look at this. Yes, so you can get um, your tape roll pack and 3D white core foam adhesive squares for just 13 97 And that's going to be a great addition to anybody's crafty stash. Oh, yeah. Right. Let's have a look at these. So these are the selfies that we've been working with today, and they're just gorgeous, utterly gorgeous. So we've got that one and that one. Bringing, well, bringing you bang up to date with your crafting. How many times do we hear grandparents say, I want to make something that is cool for my grandkids? They don't think I'm cool. These are, these are. And uh, you can get them. Your code is 711017 for that. Um, and you've got your Flexi Buy on there as well. Let's have a look at these stamps down here. Shall I read? Hang on. I'm going to spin it around and, and actually read them. So we've got Smile. Congratulate your selfie. Yep. Yeah. Um, you help make me my best selfie. And our friendship is picture perfect. That's just the ones down there. I couldn't read them back to front and upside down. You've got down here as well, all sorts of other ones. Oh, we just click. You're Insta famous, you're so cute. And then you've also got that little heart down there. So you see, this is your classic, isn't it? With your, um, you could you could do black and white photos and things. You could you could do all of that. Yeah, it's it's a film strip almost, isn't it? And then you've got your Polaroid, uh, just brilliant, absolutely brilliant. And of course, reflecting that trend that we have at the moment for photo booths at weddings and any kind of special occasions, just to capture that moment because otherwise it's all on your phone and you don't see it. So get those photos out there. Um, Twenty six pounds on your two flexi buys. Come and have a look at this. I adore these. So you can put your gift vouchers in these. You can make them into shaker cards. That way. You can make them into shaker cards. And you're getting 10 of the pouches there. And you get the, um, the die to cut out that bit. And then the die that cuts out the frame. See that green frame? Cuts out that. And then you get 10 of these little plastic pockets. Can you see there? that you can put a gift card in. Genius, absolute genius. It's one of those things that I looked at and went, yes, of course everybody needs this. And of course you get all these stamps as well. So those sentiments for when you do give that, that gift. Thank you for going above and beyond. Well, that's a gift card for a teacher, isn't it? Your end of term gifts, what do you give them? You know, how about, how about a, a coffee shop card? Really, really lovely. You know, as we move into, you know, giving experiences more than gifts, that's a brilliant way to go. 889689. Let's have a look over here. The circle shakers. So we're along the same kind of lines in terms of having those plastic little pouches. And uh, so these are what you get, 10 of those. And they slot in. So once you cut out these you've got a star and a heart there and then you've got your frame and then you can just build it up and you've got hang on what does it say happy happy birthday it's just a happy birthday one that one well which is perfect and again absolutely timeless and you're going to be able to use that male female any age absolutely perfect and that's 0639 Eight, eight is your code there. Why not build on top of having those in your stash then and get some more sentiments that then work beautifully with that. Um, again, if you want to use those plastic pockets with there or just have them as standalone, then you absolutely can. Now, what have we got there? It's back to front and upside down. Uh, buh, 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 buh. We've got congratulations, uh, big hug and thank you. Lovely. And look, look at what you can do. So if you wanted to bring in, there you go, there's your shaker card. Fab. But you don't have to have it with the, with the plastic pouch, you don't have to. It's entirely up to you. Yeah, the mouse does need a heart nose, doesn't he? Beautiful. What a lovely addition to have. Make the most of, um, of the flexi-buy, if you've got the flexi-buy already open. 
make the most of it. Uh, 638371 is your code there. Let's have a look at the next ones. Stamps and dies. How useful is this? Save you so much time if you want to cut them out. Uh, then here we go. You've got hello. You've got smile. Really just happy, happy, happy. Oh, we've got hugs in there as well. There's your hello. With lots of different sentiments. Look at all of these. So many. Made with a smile. My favourite things. A smile face. A smiling face is a beautiful one. You always bring a smile to my face. So many of my smiles begin with you. And that's just on your smile one. So many there. And then over here you've got your hello. From me to you. Yeah, you've got the die that cuts it out. Let's have a look at some of these. I'm sending you a smile. Have a really great day. All sorts of different sentiments there. And then stamp it and then cut it out with your die that goes with it. So you've got the hello and your smile. And they, they become toppers, don't they? I don't know about you, but whatever, um, whatever card kit I get, they're always the toppers that I run out of. So as soon as you can stamp and die set, uh, die cut, you've got your own, haven't you? Absolutely. 308601. Let's have a look over here at our flowers. This was, well, flowers and succulents. Do succulents not class as flowers? Oh, I think that there must be. They do flower, don't they? They're more the leaves. These are the leaves of the succulent, aren't they? No, no, look, I love how exquisitely that's been coloured in. They've got, you know, the little pink tips of the succulents. The detailing in there is just beautiful. They're just, they're just termed as plants. Yeah, flowers are plants. There we go. So you've got, um, you've got your more traditional ones over there. And then you've got gorgeous, gorgeous flowers over there. And miss you. Hi. All sorts of different things. These are your fantasy florals. And then you've got your um, rose garden there. Who doesn't love roses? And of course, because you're stamping, you can build up an entire bouquet there. They're sizable, aren't they? Really sizable. Right, let's have a look at this tag builder that we started to have a good old rummage around and that we used in the last demo with Catherine. And again, if you're journaling, as we said, these are perfect for that uh, because you've even got the little ring, ring binder keepers, if you will, if you want to use them for that. And they're just along there. Just brings a bit of difference to a page, doesn't it? And then you had all those little hearts that were used on the paws and the nose. And then you've got your stars. So you could cut those out and then use those in your shakers. And then you've got all of your circle dies that you can just build up and build up and build up and tags. I'm trying to, with all of the birthday parties that my kids go to, um, just do brown wrapping paper, but then do like a real showstopper tag. That would be perfect. So 061641, that's your code for those. Now let's have a look. This is the wonky stitched rectangle nesting die kit. Get all the words. I've got all the words. And there they were. Um, 800609 for something a little bit different. If you wanted to get some beautiful threads out, I've got some lovely variegated threads. They'd look beautiful threaded through those. Um, if you wanted to do that, but otherwise you've just got the effect there. And that is stunning enough on its own. 800608. But you've got that potential. You've got that possibility. And that's why they are stunning. And then we've got stitched ones next giving that little bit of extra something to your dies. And here they are, you're getting two sets here. Again, of your nesting dies, your square and your circle. These are classics, aren't they? Absolutely fab. And again, bit of wonky stitching going on around there. And that is on, um, oh, we go, 125832. And if you're spending over 60 pounds today, why not put it in a flexi order? Why not? Why not? But get a head shop on the web. It's all there. But this, of course, is one of our brand new arrivals. There are your selfies. Catherine's favourite. <laughs> Fast becoming mine. I adore these. I know. Have you got a favourite uh, character in there? Um, I would think. Well, I love the monkeys. It, I think the monkey's mine, actually. But then I, I also like well, the though. long suffering dog. Yes. Because it does yeah. remind me of my great Dane Eric when we had when we had our kitten. 
then he just he he just couldn't work out why Aww. this thing was climbing all over him. Aww. And was it okay? Because you know he's twelve stone of dog. Was it okay to have a small kitten on his head? <laughs> Is that okay. <laughs> you know he was like you know asking for a friend. <laughs> Oh dear, that's hilarious. Right, now then, I'm using one of the, um, I've forgotten the official name for this, it's the one with the pouches. The oh, well, the, one the circular one with yes. the pouches. The circle shaker? Yeah. yeah. Um, Are you going to shake? Do you know, we might, we might turn it into a shaker. Really? Uh, I just want to show you just the basics of this, because there okay. are other dies that work with it as well. So, now you get the outer die, which makes a beautiful frame, if you just want to use that as a frame. It's handy to have, isn't it? It is very handy to have. Now, this is the inner bit. This is going to cut the hole out. Right. So this you could use, obviously, to neaten up afterwards, but we've got other options as well. So I'm just going to send this card through the die cutting machine just to cut out that hole there. So actually, you could be making yourself just an aperture card at this yeah. point. Yeah. That's what, effectively what you mean. You certainly can. I'll show you the frame cut out because I have got one cut out as well. So I'm just sending that through. Obviously, I don't want to keep my card folded, otherwise I'll be cutting through both sides. Right, okay. okay. <laughs> so, which we don't want. So there we have our little aperture. It gives it a nice little edge as well to it. It does it? give it a nice little edge. It gives it sort of a little embossed edge. But if you wanted to use this one, you see, you get a really nice frame that could go around. Yeah. So that in a contrasting colour or you could ink it up or do your various different now, you effects. you see my, um, my in-laws like to go cruising ah. so that you could make that into a little porthole. Yes that's a good idea, yeah. a very, very good idea indeed. And it could be them. It could be them. On their cruise ship. <laughs> It could be that you, yeah. could, you could have them inside the portal, I could. like in the selfie With the, booth. Yes, yes, yes. You could do that. Cool now, cats. <laughs> Would the cats work Would um, they in there? We can have a look. I've got one that's kind of part coloured in here. Let's just put it behind the aperture. You could do oh, that. Oh, look, look at, that. at that. Yes, because you of could. Course, <laughs> of course, you could cut the cats out with that dye and pop them behind there. Oh. So you could do that. Should we do that? They're not coloured in properly, but we could what do that. What were you going to do? Sorry, I'm hijacked uh, well, it. <laughs> okay, carried away, I could, I could do with some little fish bones or, <gasps> or something to a shake yes, it for the cats, that would couldn't be I? That would look really good. Um, oh, you know, if anyone if has... you've got punches, like banana, little bananas or thing, you could make, you know, for the monkey. Look at what you've already got, because... I was thinking, it took me a minute to catch up. Why would cats want bananas? <laughs> what I was thinking. <laughs> Forgot no, they were monkeys. There's lots of different animals on there. I so get there in the end. Don't look at what you've already got. Yeah, yeah. You know. yeah. Uh, right, okay. Um, adhesive on plastic, what do we need? Right, well I've just got a very good PVA here. Actually I'm going to put some card on the back which is going to really secure anyway. Okay. You could use tape but just for speed I've just gone with that. Maybe use some tape in there, I just want to make sure that that's in there ready to go because oh, okay. of course then if you want to put something that's going to shake around and I have got some sequins of and course here so let's just, let's just pop one or two in there. And then, of course, you would put a picture behind there if you wanted one. Um, well, what about gold wedding anniversaries? Gold wedding anniversary gold would be glitter great. and things in there. Exactly, yeah, you could do that. Do you know I might just put this behind. I know it's not coloured in, but let's just see if we can... Now, I'm being out. I know Kim's just asking a question about water and gel. There she is wants a to way. put a watery gel thing in, doesn't she? Um, there is a way, actually, that you can put water into shaker Is cards. There? Yeah, you have to put you have to put something else in there though to eh. It's difficult. Water is going to get everywhere. It's very difficult. You've got to seal it properly so you'd have to use a silicon a silicon gel to Oh, okay. What about a but silicon you can, glue? You can gel. use you could you can use hair gel. You often I don't know do you still get it? We see in the what? 80s when we used to do our hair, we used to get blue and green hair gel. You can put that inside. You get purple and pink as well. Oh, yes! Yeah. Yes! Yeah. I've dropped half my sequins out of there now. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, <laughs> done a very good in job our of excitement. <laughs> I've done a very good job of that, have I? Wow. <laughs> I think we, you know, they're excitable cats. <laughs> <laughs> That's what's going on there. Now, you do, you do need to make sure it's sealed properly, of course. So, of course. lots of glue and tape around there. If you're using foam tape, um, obviously, you don't really want that on the inside of the card because you're going to cause a ridge. Okay. 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 So, all right. Uh, I would probably use a red liner tape normally. 
All right. That's fair And enough. because it's a circle, you can sort of cut it into little bits and work it around the shape of there. But this wasn't planned like this, to be fair. I just thought I'd put the little cats behind Well, there. we are loving the little cats. <laughs> they, have been, they have been great fun. <laughs> we should have put those little hearts in there, shouldn't oh, we? Oh, yeah, we should have done. We should have put the little hearts in. But is what you can big? do, of course, is go with those other sentiments for oh, bees. So big, big hugs. hugs. Big hugs. Shall I just send one of those through the die cutting machine? We'll do it. Let's do cut it. another yeah. one out just so you can see these cut as well. We've got thank you there. Let's just send that one through. So you've got different options. Now the other um, one that has comes with the plastic pouches is the gift card one. Genius. I mean, where has this been all my life? I, I end up having to try and make <laughs> boxes and all sorts just to make it look like more than just you know more than just I've just given you that. Or you end up buying something else to give them with it, so it doesn't just. Look. Yes. Um, or am I the only uh, one that no. does that? No, 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 definitely not. Here we go. Definitely not. Let's have a look at this. We have got here. Here are things. I've got them in the right place now. A little gift and big thanks. This one's on me. Best gift ever. Feed yourself. Yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> <laughs> it's perfect. <laughs> I'll just stop that. Just feed yourself. Yeah, go on then. Thank you for going above and beyond. A gift for you because you're awesome. Yes. Your hard work has not gone unnoticed. Oh, no, it hasn't. Spoil yourself. It's on me. Uh, for all you do. Uh, thank you. And a little something for you. It will be okay. This will help. Is that for another? Did, did our licenses do her? <laughs> And a great big happy birthday. I'll have to look into oh, <laughs> no, I've just cut out thank you as well, just so you can see. So they cut beautifully. I'm just popping out the little excess bits there. Uh, I've just used black card, but of course you could do all sorts of different coloured cards. Actually, I wish I'd done a rainbow one now. How long we oh, got? Gorgeous. Well, these are fab, aren't they? And just they those are. little, those are sentiments as well that just say what we need to say. Um, That's for all thought. you do. I mean, that's Mother's Day. Just had a little thought. I don't know if this oh. is going to work. I don't yeah. know if it's oh. going to work. Oh. Are you using uh, it as a stencil? I'm going to see how it looks. I haven't tried it, so I'm just going to... Shall we have a go? See what well, happens? Yeah. So that's Why the not? outside. So you've got your thank you there. Oh, so it'll echo it. Oh, I like this. Let's just see. I've got to be a little bit careful because there's some quite dainty bits yeah. there. So yeah, I want yeah. to sort of pull it out from the outside thank there. You. It may not work, but it'd be we, interesting um, to see. My son and I went on a road trip the other weekend. Um, a friend of ours in Wales wasn't very well, so we jumped in the car to go and check on him. And, um, and on our way back, because my husband was left with the baby, um, and he's like, we could just stop off and buy Daddy something, you know, for, for having Emily all day. Oh. <laughs> like, you mean like I do? <laughs> Every day. <laughs> but bless him, the sentiment was absolutely there. Oh. And, uh, and so he probably would have been very happy making a little card like that. Oh, I'm sure he would. Get the family involved, that's what I say. I always include the kids. Oh, that's it does, great. You can't see it a little bit. I'm just thinking as a, in a background, you could yeah. kind of do splodges and you can make out. I just wondered how it would look. So you could... You could it does. It looks like... Um, or if it, you, someone's into paintballing. <laughs> yes. You could do it like a paintball, <laughs> but with thank yes. you over it. <laughs> you could, couldn't you? <laughs> So your little card, obviously you've got options then, you can change around, you can decide which one you're going to use, but very, very simple to do. And if you want them a little bit thicker, obviously cut more than one out and then build them together so you get a real up. thickness. Yeah, nice. layer them up so you can, you can make something really, really firm. Try cutting your foam and that sort of thing with them as well. It depends on the thickness, obviously, but sometimes we, we can cut foam even with the thinner dies, so you, that's another option as well. Mm. So, right, we haven't got long left, have we? What have we got? Shall we? What would, you, what would you like me to do? Um, oh, shall, we, shall we do another selfie? Yeah, go on. Which, shall we go for the monkeys? Then? Let's go for the monkeys. Go on. Okay, let's do the monkeys. Right, let me grab my stamping platform. And again, this is this would be a great uh, great one for grandparents as well, wouldn't it? It certainly would. If anybody, got, if you, yeah. I think it suits absolutely anybody. Now, where are my gigantic scissors? I shouldn't lose Why them. Why are they so I? small? <laughs> uh, you could put them down anywhere. 
just roughly cutting this because I'm going to cut it down. Are you sure it wasn't just set dressing? No, no, no. Um, <laughs> I think Leone had something to play with as well. I think we were all good. Well, they'd be bigger you know, than Leone. Yeah. Come on. <laughs> but they are really, really good scissors. Really good scissors. Right, so I'm just going to pop that there. I'm sitting the card into the corner because if it doesn't, if it doesn't um, print straight away, at least I know where that placement okay. is. Do okay. we stamp first, then cut out with the die? Is that rule of thumb? Well, with this one, when I did the first card, I just roughly cut around that because the die that went over as a frame is a separate die. Okay. Has it gone? We've got this one as well, you see, that comes with it. We had the uh, the window frame one, yes. the, the single yes. one, yes. and then you've also you also get this one with it as well, with the three separate ones. So uh, the other one it is. It'll be buried under here somewhere. Oh, I've got no. Hang on. No, oh, no, no, oh, no, 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 no. Um, <laughs> <laughs> we'll get the one off the counter shall we <laughs> would that be easier <laughs> that one that's the one. Oh, hang on that's it's the like one you've been at that one as well look at it fabulous and you've got space for stamping down there or you could stamp onto that see i think that would also make a great tag i'm all about gift tags at the moment it would make a great tag yeah. it certainly would yeah, yeah i'm just wondering if one of those tag dies would work nicely as well. Look at the detail in there, they're really, really it's fine very detail. very crisp and clean, it is, isn't, isn't it? it? It's gorgeous. Let me just pop that there, get rid of this so we can see a little bit better. Isn't that fab? Um, so let's find some colours. I'm going to go with the oxides again. I love this little one, looking slightly dazed and confused. I know, I I'm, I'm, might risk it and see if I've got a a pen that's the right sort of colour actually. Oh, it's a bit pink but never mind. Let's just colour in the little face. <laughs> now these are alcohol pens so I would build up the layers with these. I would go in with shading but I know we haven't got a lot of time so. So these can be used with all different mediums can't they? They're so versatile. Certainly, certainly can. Do you know I've even, I've, my plan was actually yeah. to go with um, <laughs> to go with flowers during this. Oh yeah, you this, did want to go with flowers, didn't you? The and then we came and had we'll a little look along. We'll have to do that at seven o'clock. We're back at seven o'clock. Are we? They are beautiful, actually. Absolutely Come on, beautiful. Should we, should we have a little reminder of the flowers because they're lovely? Not just flowers. You've got the succulents as well in there, which I, I love because if you don't want to send traditional, traditional ones, then you've got you've got different ones. You do have, and again, these are all made in the states. You do have your rose garden. There they are. I mean that's a that's a big yeah. you could almost stamp your own wrapping paper couldn't you with that big one you could actually that would make some that's beautiful beautiful that's wrapping paper. i love them all but actually is that well favorite? yeah but what about know. the i like the succulents uh this one is your fantasy florals lovely aren't they, they and are then gorgeous. your last one oh it's got your sentiments on it as well with miss you love and thanks and hello and hi and this is your flowers in bloom. They're lovely, aren't they? Mm, really, really, really lovely. lovely. You've lost me now, I'm colouring. I know, you've gone <laughs> very quiet. I'm doing some local oh, look at rosy them. cheeks. Oh. I'm not quite sure hey, whether yeah. this one... Yeah, I think you need some cheeks Little monkeys. And what I would do then is go back over the top with my paler colour just to sort of pull all those colours in. Oh, We're going to run out of time, gorgeous. aren't we? Oh, look at his tummy. <laughs> See, it's one of those things, the more you look at it, the more you find really cute little things to look at. I just, look, he's winking, he's got his thumb up. He's a cheeky monkey, He that is one. a cheeky monkey. I mean, I love just the bemused look on the one behind. I think anybody that's got two children understands that the smallest always wants to keep up with the biggest. <laughs> and, and it, you know, and there is always that look of, what are you doing? <laughs> you How old are yours, your children um, now? Just then? turned six and 15 months. Really? Yeah, so smallest, um, as we call her, she, um, yeah, she is, she is always two steps behind Freddie. Is she? Yeah, oh, always. Yes. She absolutely adores him, and this is them to a T. Absolutely them to a T. If you could have put them in monkey form, 
it would be like this. It's even got a little sticky uppy hairdo <laughs> going on there. It's just perfect. Oh. Now we've also got on the show lots of different frames for you as well, and um, and they are they are incredibly lovely to work with. We well, look look look. Yeah, look at this. This is the wonky one. This is what we used last demo, wasn't it? We did Which actually. Was fab. Yes. Just bringing that little bit of difference. We've all got rectangles, but what about rectangles with a difference? Here they are. Here they are. But of course, if you're after the full the full shebang with your squares and your circles as well, then there it is. One, two, five, eight, three, two, and then you've got the complete set. Do you have to have complete sets of things? Are you that sort of girl? Um, yes. <laughs> I do actually, okay. yeah, I, I do. Uh, I'm terrible. You know what I'm like here? I, I'm always running upstairs and, oh, me too. and purchasing. Um, if sometimes it feels a bit like Challenge Annika if I want something off yeah. the first hour and it's like, can I get up there before the show starts? It's it's like Clarity last week. I Did you wanted indulge? the one day special but I ended up buying everything that was on the counter. Well, you know, it happens. Yes. Unfortunately for me, my bank balance did take a bit of a hit sometimes it's um it's like we just get paid in product isn't it <laughs> <laughs> that's that's effectively that's how it, it works it's just too tempting you think it's bad for you at home just imagine because we actually get to see it and feel it and see the quality that's what's shining through here yeah. for me is the absolute quality of this the quirkiness of having the um the shakers the brilliance of having the gift cards the up-to-date feel of the selfies but also that timeless feel of having um, either a film um, film strip or your photo booth it's just genius it really just is. genius you know, I'm just going to add a little bit of background here and I'm using I'm using some ink for the background just water and ink just to sort of pull some color into there as well are we doing this again at seven? We are doing this at oh, seven. Oh, fabulous! With Alex, I believe. Oh, not with me. Oh. <laughs> so, I'm trying to get some Alex flowers in. It. I think at seven. Go on then. Uh, and maybe, do you know, I'm just going to have a play in between shows as well. It's no hardship, is it? It's just, oh, they're just gorgeous. Have you checked out your baskets? Have you made sure that you've got these? We've managed to get these for you from the States. Uh, this is steel made in the USA, not made in China or anything like that. This is made in the US of A. Um, it is, and, uh, and it's, that's where it's been shipped for. Top quality, fabulous. They are. Bit quirky, bit different. Absolutely just love it. Just great fun. Just have fun with them. That's Absolutely. the main thing. Thank you very much. I've had fun. Thank you.